is up you guys welcome or welcome back to my channel for today's video we are actually doing my first ever monthly favorites which i think is pretty cool i have like a little bit of everything so first i'm just gonna start with beauty because i have it right next to me so let's get into it i'm gonna go ahead and start with hair care i just have two products so i don't have my extensions in right now this is basically my natural hair it's pretty straight it's very very thin as you guys can see my hair has been getting very very dry at the ends i have pcos and hashimoto's disease i know you guys heard me talk a lot about it on my channel so basically with that comes dry brittle hair and also hair loss so what i have been doing is taking prenatal vitamins i'm gonna go ahead and put a picture here because i have them in my room i decided to take prenatals to help my hair growth and my doctor recommended it to me and so far i've really been loving it and my hair has started to grow and that's why i have like a lot of baby hairs coming up so really happy about that now this is argan oil of morocco it helps to revive smooth and restore luster to damage dry and coarse hair as you can see i used a lot of it I put this in my ends in the nighttime sometimes when i'm sleeping i even put it when i get out of the shower i really really like this i think it's great now also from the same brand this brand is called ogx um, I also have this coconut oil right here. This is a weightless hydrating oil mist. I go ahead and I put this in my hair after I finish washing it. It's to help leave hair hydrated, soft, touchable, and healthier with each use. Now, I do recommend if you don't like your hair feeling oily and you do have fine hair like myself, you could use this as a little hair in treatment, then wash it off. I sometimes, what I do before I go to bed, I put some in my braid. Like while I have my hair in a braid, I just like spritz it on and it's been leaving my hair really nice. So I'm gonna hop into makeup because I just have a couple things that I wanna show you guys, nothing crazy. As you guys know, I keep my makeup very, very minimal, so <laughs> I don't really have anything epic to show you guys, but if you do have oily skin and you do like light coverage, but you want maybe a little bit more of a coverage that way and something that's buildable, I totally recommend this. I was shopping with my friend Maria and she recommended this one to me. It's the Neutrogena Healthy Age Skin. This is the color light to neutral. It has SPF 20. What I like about this is that it's not oily on my face and I already have really oily skin. Now I also recommend, which is like everyone's been talking about this concealer, but it is the e.l.f. Hydrating Camo Concealer. I am in the shade Medium Sand. Not drying, not cakey, it's buildable. I really like this. I know some people don't really like it, but I like it. And it does increase under my eyes, so totally recommend. This is gonna look so gross on camera, I don't even wanna show it, but it's this little like eye, eyelash, comb i guess so i was watching my friend morgan's channel and i will leave her channel down below so she had mentioned this is like one of her favorite little tools to use to brush out her eyelashes and stuff to like separate them when your eyelashes get like clumpy full of mascara if that makes sense i have a lot of good mascaras but sometimes they just get really clumpy and that's just that's not the vibe we want so i got this and i actually love it i think it's so good it separates the lashes perfectly so you don't get that like clumped up look and it's pretty cool i really like this tool dollar tree nail hack if you haven't seen that video i'm gonna go ahead and link it above I really really love these nails from sassy chic they're just a fun and easy way to get your nails done when you're in a rush or on a budget and these aren't the only styles they have they have tons of different other styles so totally recommend these as well if you guys haven't tried the ordinary i totally recommend this brand i think they are so affordable there's a ton of other things that i want to try from them this is the ordinary hyaluronic acid even though i do have oily skin my face, I don't know if there's anyone else out there that can relate, my face also gets very, very dry. I am a person that likes to put their serums on in the nighttime. That's just how I am. That's just how I flow. Love the Ordinary Hyaluronic Acid. I think it's great. I love the little dropper. I think it's so cute with the dryness and like the cracky, flaky skin. Oof, it has improved a lot. So recommend that. Alaya Skin. I really, really like their Vitamin C Supercharged Serum. I feel like my skin has gotten a lot brighter and I just, it also has hyaluronic acid in it. So I'll use this like three times throughout the week and I just feel like my skin has gotten a lot brighter and I love the packaging and this is vegan and cruelty free. It's made in Australia. I think it's a good buy. Pink Clay Mask. I personally really, really enjoy this product. 
it sucks out all the oil and dirt from my skin while leaving my skin soft and bright. The Laneige sleeping mask, I have the flavor sweet candy. Let me tell you, a little goes a long way. I didn't want to buy the full tub of this because everyone was talking about it and hyping it up. And then I was like, if I don't like this product, I'm going to be so mad that I just spent a crap ton of money on this freaking sleeping mask. But turns out I actually really like it. So I got the little pack. I'm going to see if I can link it down below or if they still have it in Sephora. It's like it comes with a gloss and it comes with this. I love the lip gloss and I'm not even a lip gloss person. Just saying. I have it on right now under my lipstick and then I put like a little like sparkly thing on top. Really cute or whatever. So as soon as I finish this little mini one, I am going to go ahead and purchase the full size. I think I found this on TikTok and I wanted it. Now, did I need it? Absolutely not. But treat yourself. Treat yourself, queen. Now, look at this. Look at the presentation. Wow, wow. Now, look at this. Hold on. I just, I need you guys to see this. Oof. Do you see that? Do you see that? Do you see that lushness? So, this is a face mist. I don't really know what this is for, <laughs> but I really, really like it. And I like, like, the luxurious feeling that you get. I just think it's so cute. It's travel friendly as you can see. Maybe when you have like a chill day at the pool and you want to just mist yourself. I don't know why you need this guys, okay? But I really liked it and I wanted to show it in my video. Don't judge. A couple items that I want to talk about is just like, I guess, fitness and outfits. Like fitness, health, you know, whatever. So these are booty bands. Now these are from Blogilates. If you guys haven't seen my video, I did the 21 day tone Blogilates challenge. Now, these bands, thebomb.com. I seriously love them. She does have rubber band ones. I totally do not recommend those. Love you, girl. Love you. I love Blogilates, but the rubber band ones are not it. These are it. These are where it's at. They do not roll up. They do not pull your hair. They're the bomb. They come in two different sizes. So I think, yeah, this one is like the tougher one and this one is the more looser one. It's just great. The fabric is great. The quality is great. Totally recommend these. I love these tights. Now they are a little pricey. They're more on the pricier side. I believe I paid 50 or 55 bucks for them. Now I am gonna be starting like running again and all of that stuff. I couldn't because I just got my wisdom teeth taken out. So my doctor was like, yeah, you know, you can't run yet, but I'm going to be starting and I totally recommend these tights as well as the fabletic ones my boyfriend is sleeping in the other room or else i would have showed you but i'm gonna go ahead and link the fabletics one as well down below i think they are amazing great quality not see-through now they do lift up quite high i personally like that i like to feel snatched and put together and just mm, like held inside so they keep everything like nice and juicy and they make your butt look good priorities i mentioned these shirts in my amazon favorites as well but i wanted to show them again because this shirt right here it's like this little crop situation they are very breathable they come in a set of three so you can choose whichever colors you want i just really really like these they're super breathable comfortable sometimes i don't even wear them to work out i just wear them to chill around the house with like a sports bra these kind of have like that jogger flare at the bottom they're more like for chilling around the house vibes and for maybe going grocery shopping or something, they're very comfortable. I like them. No complaints, no issues. They even have like this little pocket here for I don't know what, but it's there. And yeah, it's really cute. The last pair of kind of like tights and jacking situations is right here. I really like these. They again kind of cinch at the bottom. If you're looking for cheap loungewear. Amazon is always the way to go. I did also want to share some blue light glasses that I got. Now these come in a set of three or four, I believe. Hello. Anyways, I need to stop. If you guys don't know, like blue light glasses, they're the bomb. Got this in Target. I'm going to see if they can find it, but it's this little ring light situation. So whenever you're outside taking a selfie, you can have your little, oh my God, what? What? You know? You can like FaceTime with a light. I thought it was cute. It's actually really good for when you want like cute Instagram shots of like your food and it's dark outside. This is the bomb. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys will probably see that I've been posting about this every Saturday. 
I like to take Saturday to like decompress and focus on myself and my family and spend time with them. And I got these things. If you don't remember, because like I'm old and I'm a 90s kid, I'll put some pictures above so you guys can see like what I mean. But you basically make little things and you iron it and then it turns, you could turn it into like a keychain or just keep them anywhere. These are really cute. I think it's a fun activity to do with your kids or by yourself. And I am such a kid at heart. So when I saw this, I just had to get it and I love it. I think it's great. I actually got this purse. It's not really a purse. It's kind of like a book bag purse. And I got it in TJ Maxx. It was $25, but I thought it was really cute. Now, I personally love what's in my purse videos. So if you guys want me to do one, can you let me know in the comments below? <laughs> Cause I really like it. I think it's so cute. It has like a cute little pouch here. You can put a little hand sanitizer. I really wanted to show you guys this because I personally really love this planner. I think it's big enough for where you can write enough in your like sections, big enough for you to do tasks. I really want to try and stay more organized, not just for YouTube wise, but for me. Like your mental health is so important. And I feel like I, I know a lot of my YouTube friends can relate to this and people who maybe even don't do YouTube, your you time, me time, whether that be being on TikTok for an hour or reading a good book or binge watching your Netflix show for eight hours, whatever it is, you need to do what makes you happy. And I feel like for the last couple months, I've been so on work, 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 that I have been forgetting to prioritize myself. Sorry about the noise, guys. But why is it getting louder? Mm -hmm. Oh my God, please stop. Why are you building like that? stopped oh thank you okay i just wanted to say i think planners are great and it has become one of my favorites every sunday morning i will get my little coffee and i will go outside of my balcony and i will literally just write in my planner and plan out my week plan out my day give myself motivating quotes it is so important during this time and what is happening around in the world to focus on yourself and your mental health. I had to switch up the little camera situation because I wanted to show you guys some of the tech stuff that I've been loving and it was gonna be too hard for me to disconnect and show you everything, so let me show you guys. The tech thing I wanted to show you guys was this keyboard. Daniel went ahead and got me this keyboard. Now this is my work computer and sometimes the laptop situation can be very, very annoying and this is the keyboard that he got me. now. Do you see how it sounds like a little typewriter? I really like making my workspace feel like more comfortable, more my vibe, because it's like where I work and where I want to feel motivated. So I really am obsessed with this keyboard. I think it is so cute. It even comes with a matching mouse. And then I got the little matching cup with these little guys right here. And then again, this little phone holder thing that I'm obsessed with. It looks so cute. I love the blue vibes, mermaid vibes. Last but not least, my MacBook Pro. I just got it. If you haven't seen that video, I'm going to go ahead and link it above. But Daniel got me a MacBook Pro. I still have to like play with it and set it up, but I'm just so eternally grateful for this. Just want to let you guys know, I know I said that I was going to do a room tour, for this whole, my filming room. I am still working on that. This week, Saturday, I'm gonna go ahead and put up all the extra frames, clean it up, cause it's a little messy. <laughs> and you guys are gonna be able to see that video soon. I also am still gonna be working on my running challenge. I'm starting running this week. So I'm definitely gonna have that video for you soon in the future. If you guys have any video recommendations down below or even wanna see like future monthly favorites, like make this a monthly thing, let me know in the comments below. I would love to hear from you. Hope that you guys enjoyed this video. These were my monthly favorites. I loved filming this. This was really fun. I love talking about stuff that I love and spent money on. <laughs> if you haven't checked me out on Instagram, please don't forget to check me out at oh hey Shy and on TikTok. And if you haven't joined the YouTube family already, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in next week's video.